Good day once again friendly viewers as you may notice this is a weird kind of setup a slightly different camera and a different sound uh, that's because I'm using my new laptop which is good news for myself mainly uh, because I've been dealing with a piece of crap that's buzzing away over there um, <laughs> and uh, so it was time for an update so I'm very glad that I got an update which is also therefore henceforth a good thing for viewers who are thinking like where, where the fuck is he gone? Why has he not made a video? So, um, yeah, so I can make videos again, basically. Um, I've downloaded uh, Sony Movie Studio Platinum Suite. I've never used it before. I don't really know how to use it. So that should be very interesting. Um, so my progression will be somewhat of a learning curve. Um, and we will see how that goes. However, more pressing matters are the topics and subjects associated with the most recent Naruto um, vid uh, video chapter which was 625 which was the conclusion of this epic flashback I must say this flashback is probably one of the best flashbacks Kishimoto has done because it was such a complete flashback it just it had everything he did he, he got all the points that we needed and wanted to see he added in extra stuff that we weren't even expecting um, and it was just really overall quite awesome. Uh, the fights in there were really, really good, but they didn't outstay their welcome. I really, really enjoyed this flashback. I'm not sure if it was the best flashback ever. That might be a bit far, um, might be a bit going ahead of myself, but I really, really enjoyed it. And it's good that it led up to the fight. It let, like sort of progressed into the fight um, that we were watching with Hashiram was like crazy slapmobile. Um, and then seeing Madara finally get killed. And what was interesting, what I picked up from the end of that, that was quite interesting, was Hashiram was like, I don't know who resurrected him or how he is alive now. It doesn't make sense to me. That's something I don't know, but blah, 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 blah. And um, he makes a very good point. And, you know, he, he's very honest. You can tell that he's very honest. And I really like how we get to know Madara a, a lot more and see really really in depth his character not only his character but his like you know reasoning for why he is the way he is and you know Madara is such a, is actually a really really good strong character um and by strength i mean not physically obviously that goes without saying um but you know strong in terms of a story storytelling you know story development kind of way he's he's a he he holds himself similar to orochimaru you know he's, he's a very strong villain um so i'm really really excited by uh, next next week because now we're back to the present time um shit's gonna get real uh, we're gonna see what's going going on with uh, sasuke sasuke looks like he has been affected by this story i don't know in what way um i'm hoping to make a, a video on how naruto is going to end because there are so many endless possibilities, which is such a good thing Kishimoto is able to do. Because there's there's nothing worse than having a story that has predictable endings. Like obviously you don't know which way it's definitely going to go, but you know whereabouts it's going to go. Uh, to for me personally, I really don't know. Naruto could go in very many different avenues, um, which you know that's with regard to Naruto and Sasuke, uh, that's with regard to the Hakage's involvement in the war, um, the uh, the Kage's that are dead or something, I don't know what happened to them, uh, but there's loads and loads of stuff that could happen and you know I don't know it's it's really really interesting time in Naruto, this is a huge turning point in the story and has definitely made the war arc uh, hugely hugely better than uh, originally or you know previously so um this is 2013 is a good year or will be a very good year for naruto uh 2012 was a bit shit um, in general uh but yeah so that was my very quick um i feel like my mouth has just gone like 100 miles per hour it's just i feel i'm really sorry about not posting a review last week just seriously the amount of shit that i've i've had to do uh with university and stuff just there's too much going on um but yeah, I'm glad to be getting back into the swing of things. So um, if you like this video, then thumbs up. Uh, well, thumbs up the video, not just thumbs up if you like it. But um, yeah, thumbs up for the video. Like the video if you like the video. Um, if you like all my videos, feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. If you have, then power to you. Um, and uh, yeah, I hit 460 subscribers, I think. So that's really awesome. I can't believe it. Four. 
460 subscribers is brilliant so um yes uh thanks for watching and i will catch you again at some point hopefully in the near future